We're going in hot. Oh boy. Oh, this is it. Pot up. Pot up, baby. <laughs> It was only a matter of time before I found myself fishing again. The last thing we need to do is Dragon Slayer. And if you don't know, Elvarg says, Oh, you have you have trout and salmon? <laughs> Good fucking luck. So we're gonna get 40 fishing and go get ourselves some lobster. Oh, look at this. Look, I got it. Wasn't that incredible the way that you didn't have to watch me fish for 12 levels and it's just right here? That's, wow, editing is great. Normally, when I'd be skilling on my main account, um, I'd be really cranky and crying that I had to cook things, but since everything's from scratch, every little level I do is is really accomplishing. It's a great feeling. The whole dopamine thing, that's, that's super real. That is not a meme. That is as real as it gets. I am super talented. So if I were to go fight Elvarg right now, she would rip my limbs apart and shove them all into my mouth. And I don't want that, so I'm thinking what we do, we get 30 base melee stats and see where we're at. Jagex, before you delay that authenticator, before you hide the poles, you take this god-awful fucking thing out of the game. I am a tank now. That is perfect. I'm still wearing iron armor. It wasn't even long ago that I helped the king next door, and I hope he doesn't know that I've just been slaughtering every guard he's ever hired. So during Dragon Slayer, we either need to pay a goblin 10k for a map piece, or we get 33 magic and tally grab it from his dead body. And if you think for a second I'm paying that idiot 10k, you're out of your mind. So, once again, we're going to invest our life savings into some runes. We are... We are poor. We are very poor. And it is... It is sad. Big moment for us, everybody. Huge moment. We are starting Dragon Slayer. I'm starting it so I can go get the anti-dragon fire shield from the Duke of Lumbridge. So, uh... I don't get absolutely mauled in the in the forehead by a bunch of hill giants. Yeah, Duke, we can install a lock on your door. No, 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 it's fine. It's fine. I don't need it. Are, are you sure you could get, like, assassinated? Nah, I don't give a shit. I don't care. This quest is so goofy because every time you bring up Elvarg to any NPC, they just immediately shit themselves and do anything they can to convince you not to fight this dragon. Dude, I... I look hot. I'll say it. I'll just... I'll say it. I'll put it out there. I look hot. I would eat ate me if I were... A guy pretending to be a girl in this game. Posted up at the Hill Giants, aka Bots Paradise, and um, already got two levels from the runes I bought, so I'm hoping these last me until 33, or I'll cry myself to sleep. Good news, everybody! About to hit 29 magic! Also, I'm out of runes, so I'll go fuck myself! Lucky for me, there's a group of individuals who choose to be free-to-play Iron Men because they hate themselves, but they also have made guides, and one of the money-making methods in there is to mine a bunch of silver, turn it into unholy amulets, and then sell them all to the general store. So we're gonna give that a shot, the old college try. Hey guys, I've had six kids, and they've had two kids. I'm a grandfather now since I started. Uh, making these things, but we're gonna go sell this to the general store and see how much we get from that So I just realized that random events weren't uh, put into the game until 2003. So um, Whatever I get from this. I'm not gonna be able to keep it. So <laughs> Fuck me a lot of people have been telling me Jim don't worry about the whole item and area restrictions Do it as long as you're completing things in the order that they came out that, that that's all that matters, but no no Okay, there's something special about restricting myself. I've become a research madman. It it arouses me now. I'm gonna sell all my crafting lootations to the general store. I have to hop worlds a bunch of times. So Jagex got pissed. They told me to stop logging in so much. They wouldn't they wouldn't let me log in from the main screen, so I'm just dumping the rest of them into the store for 20 coins each. It's, yeah, 16k. That's that's not bad. That's kind of what I expected anyway. This has been an absolute process to get everything I need to start this next quest and after I do this, I still need to fund some armor or something, because I still only have iron. So I'm down here, I'm about to get 33 magic, by the way, but also, there's a- There's a couple down here, there it is. There's a couple down here, who's- 
They're killing hill giants together. They're trying to get the key together. The, the giant key thing. I have one in my inventory. I picked it up because I didn't really know what it was, but I googled it, uh, so I'm dropping it. But also, I don't know if this is the best thing I've ever seen, like relationship goals, or if this is like, this is probably just one guy on two screens. He's my husband in real life. What are you guys doing? So Elvarg is weak to stab. So I'm thinking out of this wide variety of beautiful swords, I'm going to go for the adamant sword. It's it's 2080 coins and it's going to it's going to do me good. I have I have a lot of confidence in this sword. I'm not going to bore you with the math here because it was, it was very complicated and engineers would have trouble understanding it, but I am going to make 31 iron plate bodies and sell them all to have enough money to buy an adamant full helm, mithril plate body, and adamant legs. This Horvik guy who runs this shop is gonna hate me. <laughs> Stop selling me iron plate bodies, I'm not gonna make a profit here. I just piss him off and hop to another world, to a different a different dimension and an entirely different Horvik and, and piss them off and just make all of the Horviks go bankrupt. Okay, we got a little over 17k, so it's time to ball out. So since I'm an Iron Man, if you don't know this, if there's any item that's overstock in the store you cannot buy it because you can't have someone sell something to a general store and then and then you know be able to buy an item you normally wouldn't be able to but someone has been overstocking the fucking adamant full helms on every world and i can't buy it god damn it lordy lordy we don't find ourselves a world with an adamant full helm we're gonna cop that real quick thank you <laughs> i need to settle down and we are geared ladies and gentlemen that is all she wrote I have been waiting for this for a long time. I'm about to start. I'm about to start Dragon Slayer. Any words of, of advice, encouragement? Okay, so there's a trick to beating Elvarg that not a lot of people know. It's that you, when your health gets low, you eat the food. Get good. Thank you. Uh, Alpha? Alright, yeah, how much content does this unlock for your account? So much fucking content. If you remember seven years ago when we were fishing and got 40, it, now is the time to use that. I just got a bunch of lobsters, I'm gonna cook them, get a full inventory, and we'll be golden to get all the map pieces and then fight that big dragon girl. Cause Elvarg's a girl by the way. Here's the deal, you ask for, for 10,000 coins from an Iron Man? You, you get hurt. You get real hurt with fire magic spells. Is that- does that feel good, Worm Brain? You like it? This is actually super messed up, but you can't be greedy. I'm sorry. This is what happens. I think he- Why is he- Oh, he- oh, he poops it out. I forgot. Yeah, well, uh, I'll take it. I'll take that from you. There's one map piece down. This is the maze. We gotta kill a bunch of things and make them drop keys, go through certain doors, and then we finally have to do a big final boss of a lesser demon at the end, which I- am terrified of. I'm in the skeleton room and I have to kill the skeleton in the back of the room with the with the circular shield, but my combat level isn't high enough yet so that these things don't aggro me. So I'm gonna have to juke around and break their ankles to get to that guy because they're just gonna keep on swinging at me the second I get near any of them. Come on baby, don't you hit me. I'm almost there. God damn it. Quick maneuvers, dodge and weave. You son of a bitch. <laughs> no, just let me attack him. I hate you. At least he's on this side of the room so he's not- Oh, you- No, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta wait for an opening like a running back. Wait, there it is. There it is. We're good. We got it. Uh, you I'm gonna quit. I'm quitting RuneScape. Round Shield Boy has not moved from the corner this entire fight. Please just attack me. Thank you. Yes, that is what we needed. Give me your key, you dumb, dumb, stupid skeleton. Sorry about my really harsh, explicit language. I'm just very, uh, I'm very upset. I don't remember this guy for some reason, but I, I, I know he's weird. Feel the wrath of my feet by the power of custard. This guy belongs in an insane asylum. This is weird. That's a cat. He just spawned a cabbage. I feel very uncomfortable. I need to feed my pet rock. Okay. <laughs> We're an actual cabbage patch in here. I think I overestimated the power of this adamant sword. It's really not getting the job done, which makes me super worried. I'm gonna use all of these cabbages and heal myself as much as I can. I need to mentally prepare for the- okay. Or I'm just gonna barge in and run away from this guy again. Alright. Well, game on. I'm trying some flicking. I've never flicked before, but I, I think I'm doing it right- and that- that really hurt. This is not going as planned so far. Oh my god. Okay, pro gamer thought. We're gonna hide for a second. Jesus. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try something. I have some runes left over from that worm idiot. So I think this is our this is really our only hope here. Let's see if we can get him down from the safe spot. And this is just not a safe spot. Can he come in here? 
He can. Wow, what do you know? Oh, all right. He can't go there. That is as far as he can go. So what I'm thinking is we attack him, run away, attack him again, and just keep running away. Oh, shit. I forgot to, I forgot to click the spell. I'm an idiot. Okay, this is perfect. He's stuck. Oh, my God. I only, have, I only have two more casts after this. Okay, at least I got him down like below half. Oh, that's huge. That's a huge hit. One more. Let's see. Oh, yes. <laughs> I just lucked out so hard. Yes. My IQ is just skyrocketing right now. Come on. Oh, stop. No, please don't do this. Please don't do this. Put your arm into it. Just thrust, sweet dreams, princess. <laughs> that's right. Sit. Yes. That entire maze was a lot harder than I remember from when I was nine years old, but... We got the piece. We've got one more to get. Okay, so the oracle's gonna give us a riddle or something, and then we solve it. Capes are always in fashion. That just does not sound remotely close <laughs> to what is, is relating to the quest. Yeah, I forgot to click on one of the dialogue options with the champion guildmaster boy, so, uh, you know, I'm really good. Okay, now the riddle is happening. Now we, now we can make some progress. I have to dump everything that I made into this door, which really hurts because I spent like 45 minutes making all of it. The final map piece. Even, even people that are dead don't want us to fight this fucking dragon. All right, there she is. Now we can glue it all together with our, with our Elmer's glue. Now we get down to business, ladies and gentlemen. I need some planks to fix up a boat. So we got to go get planks in the wilderness because, you know, we're, we're free to play still. But not for long. See, if I was a hardcore right now, I'd be pooping myself, but I'm not. Whenever I'm in the wilderness, my, my butt cheeks automatically clench and there's nothing I can really do about it. Yeah, there's a person right here. What are you doing? What's your story? Oh, it's a bot. <laughs> Wait, did you want these planks? Yeah, it's all right. Uh, yeah. I recently discovered that if you take the ingredients of a strength potion to the apothecary, he'll make you the potions. So I'm going to get red spider eggs down here and, and bring it to that guy. And there is a spider web here and I brought nothing with me. I should really start looking this shit up. I went back and got a sword, so we're good to go. So I just have to run past these spiders, pick up the eggs. I think I need nine of them. I'm just hopping worlds to get the spawns faster. I didn't bring any food, but I don't think they'll be too much of an issue. They're not they're not too strong. All right, we got all of them. So just got to break out of here and go give it to the apothecary. We've got issues. We've got a lot of issues. I'm out of run. I have no food, and these zombie things are smacking me in my mouth. I, please do not hit me. No, please go away. Okay, I'm gonna wait for my run to replenish and then sprint past these guys. I don't even know how much HP. I have six HP left. This is terrifying. I really should have brought food. All right, we're gonna book it. Go. Okay, they, really? They didn't <laughs> They didn't even swing at me. That doesn't even make any sense. We've got our potions. Now all we need to do is get Ned to be our captain and buy the boat. How does 2,000 gold sound? Depressing, Clarence. That's what it sounds like. Imagine just hitting a hole and it just patches itself. Just just whack it as hard as you can. Good as new. I gotta get my prayer points back up, so I thought I'd take an opportunity to get in touch with whoever's gonna be watching me over this journey. Dear Jesus, please let me beat this dragon so that people stop calling me Budget Swampletics. Thank you. You only live once. Wait a second. This... Ned... Oh, that makes so much sense. Well, Ned is down to do it, so... I guess we're going. There's only one thing that could possibly calm my nerves right now. <sighs> oh yeah, that's the stuff. All right, we've got we've got Cabin Boy Jenkins and Captain Ned, and they're ready to take us to Crandor, and and get us the hell out of free-to-play worlds forever. I forgot this quest was made before trigger warnings, and I am just not okay. <laughs> this quest is rated M for mature, and god damn it, I just fixed that boat. Oh, oh, okay, Elvar. You, yeah, you're just gonna kill Jenkins, <laughs> the, the, the most innocent, insignificant person to kill. You're just gonna, just gonna wipe him out. You know, I was kind of not looking forward to killing Elvar before, but apparently, she just wants to to flex on us and just start murdering people that that mean a lot to us. I mean, I I, I knew Jenkins for a, for a full five seconds, but also, dick move, dude. Honestly, stellar cinematics. I'm I'm immersed. So pro tip, before you go into Elvarg's thing, if you're you shouldn't be using this as a guide by the way, I just want to point that out. But uh if you do this in the future, you run to the other side and and push open this little shortcut over here because if you do die, which is very likely if you're me by the way, um then you can just get back in this way and get your stuff in time or else you have to build the entire boat again and I am not going to do that. We're going in hot. Oh boy. Oh, this is it. Pot up. Pot up, baby. Holy shit. Okay, 
Elvarg is just consistently hitting me. I'm just like spamming my lobsters. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm running. There's a safe spot over here. I, I need to go to it for a second. Oh my God. No, 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 no. What, is my guy dumb? Are you okay? Oh my. Wow. So here's the deal. I can definitely flinch Elvarg from this spot, but I don't, I don't really want to do that. I don't want to flinch the dragon to, to beat it. It's... It's pretty, I mean, it's not cheating, but it's just like, it's just a scummy strategy. So there's no way I'm going to beat it just, just doing this like one-on-one -on -one combat. So I'll flinch it for a little bit just to get it down, but I'm not going to do it the entire time. I got it down a little bit, so we're going to run out and, and give it our all for a second. Let's just see how we do, see if we can survive with this. Yeah, I got, I got it down quite a bit, so we'll see. She doesn't miss. Oh my god. Have mercy on me for like a se Oh my god. Aha. Uh -huh. See, I got a strength level in the fight. I bet she didn't expect that, getting stronger while fighting her. Big strategies. We got her- we got her close. She's almost done. Oh my- and she- she's hitting nines. She's hitting nines. Okay. Uh, we're gonna- we're gonna hide for a second, uh, to kinda- kinda chill out. My- my heart is racing. We're back at it. We're good. We got- we're so close. Just like a few more hits. Yeah, one more. That's all we need. Just one more hit. I'm gonna juke her out. This side. Just hit her- just, just stab her feet. Oh my god, she's hitting tens. Yes, there we go. Rip her face off. Just rip it off. Oh, yes. Yeah, you dumbass. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, I'm squatting like 160 pounds. Yeah, back from my victory. Back to the homeland. Just got a huge dragon head in my backpack. Oziak, whatever your dumb name is. I have a special gift for you. I'm just gonna hand him the entire head. It's just got blood oozing out of it. It's like, Jesus, dude. You just had to kill it. You didn't need to bring that. Oh my god, it's getting blood all over my floors. There you have it. There you have it. We have completed all of the original free-to-play quests, which I am proud to announce that actually this unlocks a ton of content for our account, baby! <laughs>